What's going on, Johnny? Sound check, can you hear me? I'm live at the boat show, ladies and gentlemen. The 2023 Miami Boat Show, which is quite an event. We got Shannon in the house. I have to remember that I have a microphone that I'm testing out. Beautiful. Okay, I'm glad to know this is working because this is a first for me. Let me uh, turn it around, in fact, and show you. I have this thing. It even has the logo on it, and I've never used it. Guys, I drove from Boca Raton, and I came down here, and I withstood the traffic and everything else that goes with driving from Boca to Miami, and let me tell you, it's worth it. This is an extravaganza. There's no other way to describe it, and it's early. It just started about an hour ago, and here I am. I got press credentials, so I'm good to go, and we have uh, free reign and access to this entire event. It's, like I said, quite a, quite a spectacle to behold. If you're in the area, come on down. I definitely uh, suggest you check this out because there's a lot going on here. It's a five-day event, starts today, goes through Sunday, and um, look at this thing. I'm gonna get the camera off of me, guys, but I wanted to greet you, say hello. It looks like 12 people found us, and uh, hi, Gail, hi, Shannon. Look at this, look at the red engines on this thing. It looks like a New Jersey Devil Mobile here. Look at this thing. Wow, I'll, go ahead, that's okay. Yeah, no, do your thing. Uh, if you buy a boat, are you going barefoot? Absolutely, barefooting. Look at this thing. Guys, I saw that I had signal in here, so I was like, why not? Let me try it. Miami is known for, this is a cigarette, by the way. I had a friend that had one of these. And, uh, of course, I'm going to probably have the usual issues with the copywritten music, which I can hear right now, so I'm going to have to try to avoid that. But, um, uh, guys, just what I wanted to tell you was that I am going to be um, at this show and popping on and off throughout. I, I loaded something up on Instagram, and uh, I did a little short. Hopefully that got to go. Look at this thing. This is a 450 Sport, 45-foot boat. 12 foot beam, 460 gallons it holds. 36 inch draft power outboard. It weighs 22,000 pounds. And it is beautiful. Let's see if we can get up on there. Can I get on there and check it out, sir? And show my subscribers? I think they'd love to see it. Look at this. Oh, it's like the old tuck and roll. Look how comfortable that looks. Oh, do I? Uh, well, you know what? That's my name, so it shouldn't be a, it shouldn't be an issue. Sorry about that. Thanks for letting me know. Um, I'll just I'll just show them from here for now. It's just going to be difficult for me to take the shoes on and off, guys. But at some point, I'll do that. Look at that. What's up, Andrew? Really? There's a surprise, huh? What do you want for $300 million or whatever it was? Hold on, I'm going to lift this up because I can do that. If you're just joining me, this is the Barefoot Vlogger live from inside the Miami Beach Convention Center. And I am at the 2023 boat show here, the Miami boat show. This is, by the way, the largest boat show in the world. And you would absolutely not debate that whatsoever if you saw what was going on here throughout Miami. Um, I secured my parking spot and reserved it, actually paid for it last night because I didn't know um, if I would be able to find parking down here. Hi. And, uh, and so I wanted to make sure that I was able to uh, get a spot. Took me almost two hours to get to Miami from Boca, but it was well worth it. This is a really pretty boat, guys. Okay, I'm gonna walk around and, um, hold on, let me adjust this. Look at this thing. Wow. What was the price? Good question. I don't think I have that laying around in the couch pillows in my house. I don't know about you guys. Look at this thing. Wow. And, and guys, they're just, I'm surrounded by them. 
there's several floors here too. And so um, I'm going to, look at all these engines, look at this. Doing good, Robert. Hi, Tally Ho. Dante, what's going on? Who did I miss? We got Shannon, Johnny. How, how is the signal looking, guys? Is it okay? Doesn't look like a lot of people are watching. This is completely impromptu. And um, maybe we could talk to some folks here and get some, uh, some perspective on what is going on here and what they have to offer. Are you getting ideas to not walk all the way to Key West? No, oh, what made you say that? I'm just taking a little hiatus. I told you guys I'm going to do that one, uh, one step at a time. Oh, Tally Ho, I wish I had the harmonica. <laughs> Thank you, Tally Ho. Ten pounds. That is awesome. I appreciate that. Thank you so, so much. You've always been so supportive of the channel, and it really helps. That pretty much covered my parking for the day. That's about what I paid. So thank you for doing that. Really appreciate it. Um, guys, it's just one boat after another. It is a sea of boats, though, pun intended. But this is just getting underway, and uh, it, will, it will be packed here. They're expecting quite a few people, and that's why I wanted to get here early and check this out and bring you guys with me. So let me get it off of me. These are nice little cabin cruisers here. That's my, that's my speed right there. Although, I like this one. This matches the blue iguana. Look at this thing. Wow. And you know what, guys? It's like a buy haul, this one. When you see a boat out of the water is when you truly realize the, the size of these things. I mean, they are just huge. It's like if you saw it on the water, the ocean is so big and everything gets lost in it but you know when you're up to them here in person you just have an idea of the size of these things you know the signal's good robert says cool thank you for letting me know that yeah i was surprised to see that pleasantly surprised as you can imagine so there's guys there's a lot going on here i'm just going to turn it around one more quick second so address you personally welcome thank you if you're just joining me it's barefoot vlogger i am live at the boat show have my credentials so we are going to get to do a lot i'm going to vlog this i'm going to do some live streams uh i might even do some collaborations here so stay tuned and uh, set your alerts if you haven't because um this is going on through sunday not sure exactly yet how often i will be coming out here it's 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 quite arduous to get here and get situated, but it's well worth it, well worth it. So if you're in the area, do what you gotta do to get down here. I would suggest getting a hotel. If you could get a hotel for the night or two nights, it just makes it a lot easier. You don't have to worry about anything. They have um, water taxis that I, you will probably see me on one at some point today that will take me from, this is Miami Beach that I'm in, in the con convention center across uh, the, you know, Biscayne Bay to the other side where they have six separate venues. I can't even call them pavilions because some of them are actually in the water that uh, are going on right now. So get it off of me. I just wanted to greet you all. And uh, what do we got here? Look at this. These have cabins. Maybe we can go inside of one. I'm going to have to take my shoes off, which I'm happy to do, but you can see them in there. See if we can go inside one of these guys. I'll take my shoes off. You see everybody taking their shoes off. I don't know how the signal's going to be in there, but let's do it. Not quite barefoot. I have my socks on. All right, here we go, guys. So this is nice. This kind of combines the this kind of combines the best of both worlds. How you doing, guys? And um, it gives you sort of a, hey, how are you, sir? This is a beautiful vessel you have here. What can you tell me about it? No, it's not mine. Oh, it's not yours? Well, it's not mine either. I wish it was. Ah, uh, these guys might know. Let's see if they'll let me. How you doing? Can I just come down and show them, sir? Yeah. 
Oh, thank you. Just wanted to check first. Wow, this is a beautiful vessel. Fantastic. Look at this. It's so roomy down here. You have these hatches here, guys, where you can open that up and get some fresh air in. It is this is a sleeper also, I would imagine, right guys? Yes, right here. Oh you could oh there you go. Look at that. Wow. What can you tell me about this vessel? Uh, one of my friends has one and he loves it. Really? This yeah. same exact boat? Yep. What what does he love about it? Uh, it's nice and easy to drive and it's a nice place for his kids to hang out or grandkids to hang out. Yeah, I can imagine. What does this boat go for, do you know? I don't know. Okay. We'll check the sticker outside. This a bathroom here? Yes. Looks like it, huh? Can we uh, take a peek in there? It's called the Intrepid, huh? That's always a great name. Oh, thank you, sir. Ah, oh, look at that. And a shower. All right. Amin, um, let's chip in. What do you think? I think it's good. <laughs> You're great. Thank you, my friend. So are you a YouTube guy? Yeah, I'm a YouTube guy. I'm the Barefoot Vlogger. Oh, I probably watch you. I hope so. Yeah, I hope I didn't embarrass myself. Not at all. Not yet. It's still early. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Oops. Sorry about that. They have cabinets here. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Guys, stand by. I have to uh, reset... The gimbal. Just give me a hard time. Hold on. Okay. Sorry about that, guys. That happens from time to time with these gimbals. When you jerk them around, I think I was doing that a little too much of it. Let me put the uh, footwear back on. Order one for me, Talio says. You got good taste, my friend. So there you go, guys. We're going to be doing some of that. I'd like to get onto some yachts, too, some mega yachts. Let's see if we can find the price. So it was a 41-foot Valor. And in case you were wondering, $1.257 million. Mere bag of shells. What's up, Indiana? Growing up on Lake Erie, we were always a boating family, OTJ says. What's up, Bo? Nothing like being on the water. That's for sure. And anybody that likes water, that's one of the great things about Florida. Plenty of it. So again, guys, I'm only on the first floor of this convention center. There are five other locations that contain some form of boats, boating, and or boating paraphernalia. And we are going to check most, if not all, of them out. You can see people uh, starting to arrive here now. Again, it's still kind of early. It started at 10 a.m. this morning, and it was mostly folks setting up and just getting here, dealing with the Miami traffic, as I had. And, um, and you will see this place quite busy today. And throughout the weekend, Chaparral always makes a good boat, well represented here. You can see other uh, YouTubers here. Hi, Ski Deeds. It is outside as well. I'm going to get outside. So let me tell you what happened with that. And I'll say hi again. Um, I won't, I promise I won't have it on myself too much, but I wanted to once again greet you and let you know here I am at the 2023 Miami Boat Show, and um, you can go and check it out. Discover Boating is their um, catchphrase, I guess, this year, and there's a lot of great information. You could go to the Miami Boat Show online and check it out. Um, come down. It's, it's certainly worth 
coming to at least for one day, if not for several days. And um, so I drove here from Boca this morning. I had a parking spot that is um, reserved for me, so I didn't have to worry about that. But the traffic, you know, was something that you, that I had to deal with. And that's why it's great if you could get a place here um, and stay here for, and make a weekend of it. I think it's a great idea, and I think it'd be a lot of fun. So. What's up, Faisal? They show pricing, I think, pretty much on all the boats. Um, this is a 43-foot solstice. Let's go check it out. 43 feet. 36-foot draft. 12-foot, 6-inch uh, beam. The beam is the width of the back of the boat. And... uh. Go ahead and take them off again. That's that's a constant uh, thing you're going to have to do here is take the shoes off to make sure we don't mark up the boat when we get on it. Look at all that seating back there. Wow. Wow, look at this guy. There's a lot of seating on here. Hey, how are you, sir? How you doing? Really? I'm great. I, I didn't mean to give you a no, be in it. Okay. What do you think? Oh, I, very nice. Very nice, yeah. You would do this one? Oh, yes. Yes, easily. Are you a boater, sir? I love boats. I don't own a boat. I love them. He sounds like me. So what do you think? Is there one in the offing? Is that one of the reasons you're here today? Well, I'm here basically. I come here every year just to enjoy the scenery of the boats. And um, I don't own one yet, but I don't know if I'm going to get one. But if I did, I do like the Midnight Express. They're very nice. Okay. Are you a Miami guy? No, no. I come from Maryland. Oh, you came down? You came down from Maryland specifically for the show? That's correct, yes. Wow. So hotel and everything, you booked you booked it as a, as a trip and a vacation? That is correct. Wow. Awesome. And um, what, uh, what do you think... When do you think you might end up on the water in a craft? Well, while I'm down here, probably in a couple of days, but in my craft, it may, I don't know, it's hard to say. I don't want to talk myself into it because if I start talking about it, next thing you know, I'll have it. There you go. I have to be careful. <laughs> I know, I know what you mean. I'll be right there with you. All right, sir. Well, listen, enjoy your time here in uh, sunny South Florida, and thanks for chatting. Yeah, thank you. Okay, Appreciate it. okay. What I'm Barefoot Vlogger on YouTube. Okay, yes, right. sir. It's live right now, actually. It's really yeah, it is. Wow. Yeah, it is. Say goodbye. Well, okay. Take it <laughs> what was your name? Uh, my name is Harold. Harold. Nice talking nice with you, Harold. Nice meeting you, too. Okay. Thanks, buddy. Look at this, guys. Wow. I don't know, guys. What do you think? Does it suit me? I tell you what, that steering wheel alone is probably five grand. Look at that thing. My goodness. Oh, it feels great too, guys. I need to get one of these for the blue iguana. Uh, I guess that's the throttle right there. Oh, it feels good. It just wants me to push up. I'm not going to, but look at all of this, guys. Ah, you thought your Tesla had some technology. Look at this thing. Scanners, radars, fish finders, all kinds of stuff. Screams Miami, Bob says. What's up, Marco? Lamborghini. It sure looks like one. Look at all of the speakers on this boat. I'm assuming that's what those, those are speakers, right, sir? Those are radio speakers there. They must sound great when it gets going. Would you mind if I asked you a question? One th thing that summarizes this boat that I'm standing on right now, with all you know about it, what would you tell our viewers at home? One thing that makes... That, that stands out about this. I mean, the, the Lamborghini theming on it is definitely very standout. How does that work? So is it you guys have a... The company has a relationship with Lamborghini to do yeah, that? So a customer wanted to match the car. Oh, so this is a particular customer, and it's their boat yep. that did this, and this boat is here for sale in the boat show. This is not necessarily for sale. It's just we're displaying it. It's part of it. I, I see you. And um, 
can you tell me how much value that adds to the boat or how much it would cost to get that done? I, I don't know the breakdown. It's up there now, huh? It's expensive. There you go. It looks fantastic. Is this a uh, South Florida boat? Uh, no, this is a Northeast boat. Really? Well, it's fantastic. Thank you so much. It's absolutely beautiful. It's a work of art, wouldn't you say? Sure. Absolutely. Sounds great. Thank you, buddy. How, how fast does this thing go, would you say? Mid-90s. Mid? And so is that, that's miles per hour? Yeah. Mid-90s. Wow. Has it gotten up that to that? Of course. Wow. So does it enter racing? No. Races? No. It's purely pre- pleasure. Pleasure boat. There you go. Okay, my friend. Thank you for sharing that with us. Absolutely beautiful. All right, guys, we're going to make some tracks. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate that. Oh, look at this. It's not just boats. <laughs> I, I guess he has. I just figured that out. He wanted his boat to match his car. Wow. I wonder who... Somebody look it up. Who owns this thing? He lives in Maryland. A lot of money up in Maryland. Wow. Holy cow, I didn't know boats could go that fast. You know what? Neither did I. I mean, 90 miles an hour? I'll tell you guys what. I've been like 45, 50 miles an hour on a boat, and I felt like I was going 100. So which one of you guys owns this boat? Me. You? That's you? What can you tell us about it? Um, one of a kind, one in a million, actually. Or one in, one in a billion. Just like you. <laughs> so do you own the vehicle as well as the I boat? I do, actually, yeah. Which one do you like better? Um, the boat or the car? That's tough. What's your favorite? The boat. If you like the boat. <laughs> I don't blame you. You could do a little more with that. It's got a little more leg room, right? A little, a little more leg room. Wow. So um, what, do you got, what can you guys tell me about the boat show? Boat show. It's a spectacular event. It's a four-day event. Um, weather is great. Miami is beautiful. If you're not here, get here. Um, and you get to see beautiful boats. Yeah. Beautiful boats. Beautiful women. Come on down. Yeah. Thank you, ladies. You're, you're the best. First. Don't forget me. The next time you take it out. <laughs> you got it. Thanks. <laughs> All right, guys. The microphone came in here. Oh, I forgot my shoes. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm going to need those. Hold on, guys. Let me put these things on. If you're just joining me, it's Barefoot Blogger. Live from the Miami Convention Center at the 2023 Miami Boat Show. And I'm putting my shoes on. And I'm going to be putting them on and taking them off quite a bit. So. Take care, ladies. Thank you. That's too fast. They look all barefoot for nothing. There you go. Formula. I had a buddy that had a formula. I told you guys. I haven't owned a boat proper, if you will. You know, anything like this. Most of my boats were like, you know, the John Boat variety or uh, rubber boat type stuff. These are really nice. Plush carpeting. Can I have my shoes on here? Do I have to take them off of the carpet? Um, Regal. Wow, that's nice. What's up, guys? Anyway. Wow, look at that. Even the engines have gotten more futuristic, haven't they? Very cool. So, guys, I am going to bail right now. So, thank you for tuning in. And the reason for that is I'm going to recharge my battery. I'm going to be coming on and off. I want to do some outside stuff that I want to show you. But um, just I want to thank the Miami Boat Show for um, giving us the press credentials to come here and uh, represent and uh, show you guys what a great venue this is. Please come out, 
you know, bring your family, bring your friends, or meet them here and enjoy this really awesome way to spend today, tomorrow, the weekend. And um, even if you're not in the market for a boat, it's just fun to come and, and dream and look at them and meet some folks and uh, have them answer your questions as well. So um, stay tuned, guys. I'll be popping back on. I'm going to recharge the phone. And um, I have a couple of surprises in store for you. So till, uh, till I catch you guys in a few minutes from the Miami Convention Center at the 2023 Miami Boat Show. This is the Barefoot Vlogger saying stay well and stay tuned.